welcome back to Diablo's Big Beltless Bot Base. My name is Diablo, and today, well, today, today I have a list. <laughs> a list of things that have to be done. Hey, Mr. Oh my god, Tomorrowland, hello, sir. The Red Eyed Sniper, hello. And Mr. Andrew, hello, are you? How are you today? Um, obviously, as I always do, I look around offline and I check out what, what is going, ha uh, what's going on in my factory. I visit it often even though i'm not streaming that but i do visit it often and look around at what can i improve what can i change how can i make it better well one of the things that i found was that in this blue section i actually forgot to limit these red boxes now you're gonna say oh but this box is limited what are you talking about Yes, that box is, but this box and none of the other boxes are. So, I need to copy that and do all of this. Well, all of this is not that much work, but you know, now all of them are limited. And we don't have that much uh, spilling over just yet, but I wanted to make sure that that didn't happen. We do have full boxes in here, which is really good news because it means that we have a buffer of sorts um we still have a little bit of a, a a lack of this but that's mainly because we don't have enough copper coming in um so i'm gonna increase this to 500 like we did for the other setups um i'm not sure that's going to be enough but we're gonna find out so how long before the first squirrel takes him away from his list well, first thing's already off my list, actually, so I'm doing I'm doing good. <laughs> I've got a little list. I've got a little list of society offenders who might well be underground and who would never be missed, says Mr. Abascotti. Who would never be missed. What is that from? I do not know that. Still suffering from too much sun on Tuesday, which was which was why I wasn't there. I was uh, here. I was wondering why you weren't here. I, um, I started imagining Im Im um, um, sad things, if you know what I mean. Um, so, please don't do that again. <laughs> okay, so we have nearly all robots and no power? <gasps> okay. Hmm, the Mikado from Gilbert and Sullivan. Ah, I need to... Okay, I'll, I'll Google that soon enough. Um, okay, we've got 50 here, no, none of them flying. Why? We're going to help out a little bit, but first I'm going to add... Poop. I'm going to add 25 of these there, so we have... Uh, oops, so we have 50 robots... Nope, we have, sorry, we have 100 robots uh, uh, even, right? That's that's a nice number to have. I'm going to help out here a little bit by grabbing half of this, half of that, and all of this, because we need more power and we need it now. Like, seriously, now. Come on, go build something. Hello? I, wait, did I not tell, oh, there we go. There we go. I have put them all on, and now they should be building everything. I'm hoping these are already on on route, so to speak. Uh, and that is why my robots are not building them. I actually have to put down some power here as well, so hopefully my robots do that ASAP, because I see blinking here. Yeah, there we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Let's go back here. And let's finish some of these. Because the more uh, accumulators, of course, we have, uh, we should be able to... Am I, uh, have I run out of... Well, I haven't run out of accumulators, so let's place, keep placing those down. But the more accumulators I have, the more we can store through the night. Oi, is that being brought? Or... Yeah, I think that's being brought. Um, and... Um, uh, the more likely it is that we can survive... Is that all of them? That is all of them. Should I steal more? And why is there a... Oh, 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 uh, oh, no. Uh, just 
just a moment. Bleh. 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 Okay, well that could be... It didn't even see those tiny ones. Let me grab some more of those, because that's interesting too. Uh, and then we'll continue with the power. Uh, where are they? Ah, they're over here. Very nice. Ooh, we got like infinite amounts. Okay, uh, that's not bad. Uh, let me just grab one stack. One complete stack, plus the six I just placed down. Eight I just placed down. Should be more than enough. Uh, let's make a <clears throat> let's make a little bl bl blueprint out of this. Actually, I can make this bigger. I don't need it to be that tiny because we've got a full complement of robots that can deliver us uh, from ev from evil. Yes. Uh, <laughs> what is that? Oh, are we picking up dead trees now? Sure, why not? Okay, here we go. That should be enough to kill most of that. We do have rob uh, we do have repair packs, so I'm not too worried about it. Oh, but I also don't have any more of these things. So let's place a few more down. And I just <laughs> don't have enough for that one. Well, now I do. Perfect. I should actually just make a um, a, a cleaner upper for uh, 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 laser stuff. So I don't have to worry about picking up trees. I think that's a smart idea. Let's see, this is lasers, yes. And I should include actually just normal power poles in this as well. There we go. Uh, save that one, pick it up, and drag. There we go, perfect. I uh, thought we killed them on Sunday. Well, uh, yes, but those were like over here somewhere. Uh, these ones, well, we've extended our, <laughs> we've extended our uh, power grid a little bit. So, yeah, it's a little, it's, it's it's understandable that we're running into new ones. It is understandable. I'm also gonna get rid of that one, by the way, because it's uh, it's really close, close enough that I want to get rid of them right now instead of waiting for that. Uh, let's run this down a little bit close. Oh, hello. You're already a little bit close, aren't you? Okay, can I just uh, entice you a little bit? Thank you. I don't need that many here. These are tiny ones, so let me just grab this and go like that and get a little bit closer. Awesome, now we can have ourselves a proper fight. All right, let's get this one there. Yeah, kill the worms. We need to get rid of that so we can do that. Excellent. This is so much easier if you have a lot of robots and a lot of lasers. Life is so much easier with robots and lasers. Wait, was there anything walking here? Did we uh, did we let anything escape? No, I don't think we did. I think we're safe. All right, cool. Let's take this out. Uh, where is it? There it is. I was blind, but now I can see. All right, let's clean all of this up. Uh, am I safe? Am I safe? Let's zoom a little bit out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, okay, I might want to deal with that one too, by the way. This one's safe. That one's safe enough. This one might be an issue. So, if we've backed up all our things... Which I should do right now. Do I still have more? I still have those ones, but that's okay. Uh, oh, I should get some power here, though. Hold on. Because all of these are in the red, meaning they're not doing anything. Which is terrible nerves. Wait, how are they not... Are we in the night? Is it night time? Oh, right. It's It was night time. It was night time. And it's now only now becoming day. Uh, actually, we still have some juice left over. So I think we, we, we've got two gigajoules of juice left over we should easily uh oh research is done uh reach the end of the night so yes helping out a little bit was a good idea okay maybe not easily but somewhat comfortably um 
Diablo helps the lower power situation by putting down lasers to make sure the power is exhausted. This is true. This is my job. Go up. Thank you. There we go. All right. Perfect. Let me turn off my robots. Let me teleport. Hello? Where's my button? There we go. Let me teleport. Eh, this is the power, closest power I can do. Uh, to here. Get a giant power pole and run that. Well, somewhere. Run that down. I'm not going to care about straight lines. Because this is not a permanent situation. Especially with killing biter bases it's not i want to be somewhere at the same level which this seems like oh there we go perfect then we can turn this around what's the distance i can place this at can i reach those worms no i cannot so we'll save god ooh ooh i almost went in without a uh, robot back on so we'll safeguard ourselves first and then we can nope and then we can place this here and make sure we can actually reach those worms. There we go. B E A U to four. So they're gonna all spit once. That's fine. Um, and we've already repaired everything. So, uh, we, oh no, I placed it in the right spot, wrong spot. There we go. I was just in time. Out, 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 just in time. All right, cool. So that's cleaned up as well. Uh, nope, I got a proper one for that. There we go. Without removing any tree. So that is that. Yes, yes, yes. You can all charge and get back into my belly. There we go. Thank you. That one, that one, and that one. So for now, we are safe. Let's have a look at the research that we want to do. I think there's nothing really that we want to do right now. So I guess we can just do some random... Well, I, okay. The brakes might be nice to have. Um, just because that makes the trains drive that tiny little bit more faster. Um, and then I'm just... Nope, not that one. I'm just gonna go for rando shit. Why not? Yeah, why not? We've got everything in spades every, every, uh, anyway. So it doesn't really matter. Oh, and that goes really fast. That's so nice to see. All right, cool, 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 cool. Now, as I was saying, let us help out with the power situation. Oh, this one's gone. How about the other one? Oops, I ran too far. And that one's gone too. Genius. Uh, okay, well, what does the power look like then? Yep, yep, there's... Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Yeah, that is, that is something. That is uh, something. Almost half of it got built. That's nice. Um. However, is that enough? We are charging, I think we're charging it fully. Um, and we did survive the night, and I'm not using lasers anymore. So, are we good? I think we should be good. What about this? This... Mm. Okay, we're buffering that now. Good, good, good. Alright, so I don't need to worry about that too much. I don't think I need to worry about that too much. Well, then we get to the heart of this... Well, heart of whatever. Uh, there's lots of things that I want to do, but... I want to move this steel uh, mill now. We do have a little bit of a buffer. But I want to bring it in line with the rest of this uh, smelting and maybe add a second line as well. Uh, but that starts with, mm, yeah, stopping these, this uh, delivery service here. Uh, and hopefully without picking up too much or too many robots, that would be nice. There we go. I might mess up some of the robots that want to try delivering, oop, deliver stuff, but I'm going to find out if that's true. Um, I'm just going to go like this. Okay, are they, are, is any, any of, are any of them stuck? I don't think they are. Oh, that's kind of cool. Nice, that means I can just go like that, 
And I should be okay to pick this up, right? Yes, we're going to run out of steel a little bit. I oh, God, I've got so much iron in my pocket. Uh, we're going to run out of steel just a little bit, but that's okay. Um, you know what? Screw it. I'll just put it all in one box. I really don't care. That's the button. I need this button. Did I copy this before I actually... Um, <clears throat> <clears throat> Perfect. I don't need those blue boxes. Anyway, as I was saying, let's take all of this away. And let's replace this in the right spot. There we go. Perfect. Uh, that does mean that this needs to go but if i'm fast enough that should not be a problem now what is the placement here that one because uh, it needs to be nope that one let's see if that's true yes that's true and that needs to be centered so like that and the boxes will go there yes so let's build this asap and then start placing down some of these boys uh, limit that, obviously, to one stack of iron. There we go. Copy that and place that. Place those down so we don't need to worry about those too much. Actually, <laughs> let me copy down four. Because then it's less clicks. Alright, so that's all of them. And I can, I guess I can, well, oh, what? we don't need that one. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I don't need to bring all this junk in front because we can share a box right there. Why does that not fit? Oh, there's a power pole there. There is a power pole there, which we will put right there. Good, good. Yeah. Uh, and then we can place this one down here and have double the amount of smelting going on. We don't need that one anymore. Uh, and then we can do that one there and that one there. Now we'll have uh, double the, the amount of steel being created. Well, in theory. How many robots do we have here? 40? Can I add some? Uh, no, because I didn't bring any. All right, let me turn off my robots. I've got them all in my pocket. I'm going to teleport over here, grab some... Of these, I got so many. This is way too many. Uh, I just want to add like 10 or something like that. Uh, yeah, because 40 goes to 50. Sure, why not? Like so. That's what I want. And what else do I want? There was something. Oh, right. I saw that I didn't have enough boxes and probably, yeah, not enough arms either. So I'm going to pick up a stack of each because everything was donezo perfect now we turn my robots back on and we wait for everything to get built and fed i do see most of them uh being um uh, uh, on <laughs> smelting let's add these 10 i think that yeah easily easily perfect okay what is our buffer size? Did we ruin everything? Oh, it's actually gone up. I thought we might have ruined it because we turned it off for a little while, but it's actually gone up a little bit. I'm very happy about that. Should we go to 1,500 or 2,000 in here? Or is that too much? Or is that too much? Because we are... I think we're on the edge because you can see that zero blinking, but I don't know if that's always been the case. Wow, all that research was done already. All right, well, go on to the next research, I guess. Oh, forgot one. There we go. Um, and our lab man is fully lit up. I wish it was night so we could see him better. Oh, well, it is what it is. Um, so we have a lot more steel being smelted. I like that. I like that a lot. I might add a few more robots to this area. Uh, are all solar, solar factories working or is there a material shortage? This is Mr. Oh, my God. Tomorrowland, let's have a look see shall we uh well the only shortage quote unquote that we have is the green chips but honestly i think we, yeah we've got a, we've got a um a surplus but there's green chips being requested everywhere here 
Um, and we only have so many robots. In fact, hold on. We've got... Yeah, everything's constantly being picked up. How many are being delivered? 60 are being delivered. And all of them are constantly being picked up. Um, so it's not a matter of adding more robots. Because we've got like half of the robots not doing anything right now. Because the only thing they need to be transporting is green chips. And green chips, although they are being delivered in a great number, are just being used constantly. So the only thing that we can really do to help out there, if we have a big enough buffer here, like, okay, there's, uh, there's about 200 here. I would love to see there be a bit more, but if I steal half of that, hopefully I stole half of that, uh, and then just push that in here. Yeah, we see all, see, even if we got 100 or more uh, green chips being delivered, instantly everything gets uh, eaten up and placed down um, so it does help obviously me doing that but it, it's going to go as fast as it's going to go obviously a lot of green is also going to red and to blue chip oops oops sorry blue chips and red chips um, should I mm. The buffer is nice. I don't see... I don't see... I mean, yeah, there's no... Uh, green chips l left behind, so to speak. I mean, there's a few here, but they're all being picked up. Um, so we have enough robots in this area. There's 150 here? Wow, well, there's 60 not doing anything, so that may be a little bit overkill. Um, all of the machines seem to be working just fine. This is requesting 1,000, 1,000, 1,000. I'm not going. I'm not going to increase that. Um, we are only delivering 400, or rather, uh, 400 per box. If we look at the amount of uh, iron that's being used, 600. That's the entire box. But this, we still have a buffer of um, about four, five hundred plates that could be picked up. So. Yeah, I think we can add a bunch of robots to that center line, and that's what I'm going to do. Let's do 200. Yeah, let's see if that's too much. I don't know. Oh, and we're going to do that a little bit closer to home, right here. Oh, and I need to move these, by the way. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, move, move, move. These ones are in the right position. Turn that around and place that down. I do, oh, sure, let's grab that one and that one. Perfect. Now they're in the right position. Now they look nice with everything else going on. Um, all of these can go in. What the fudge? Why does it say... No. Moment, moment, one moment, please. I know why that happened. Because I... Put down a forty, uh, a one, a one, uh, one stack of forty there. That that was completely and utterly my own fault. There we go. Now we should have seventeen hundred, and we've got thirty, twenty, twenty. Well, but, but okay, fifty. Somewhere between twenty and fifty not working at the moment. So we have reached the amount or the maximum of what we can have the robots do this is steel this is not iron this however is iron all 600 there and oh my god box is empty i think it's t <laughs> i think it's time for us to um, add some boxes don't you yeah i think so too so i'm going to add one below but also above actually Okay, so we should see instantly this being used, because this is obviously the closest. This, I would assume, is also being used. Okay, I was going to say not being used, because we've got three boxes that are closer, but all of these are being emptied out. So, uh, this is emptying, f or filling up fast, by the way. I like that. I like that. So, we are definitely um, improving our, the amount of iron going to the system. I like that a lot. Uh, we've got, yeah, 400 in here, 400 being picked up, 600, 700, only 400 being picked up, 
and just a little bit being picked up there, so that really doesn't matter. Are all the robots here working? All the robots are here working. That's perfect. Train just arrived, so we don't need to worry about that. Uh, what about this side, actually? This side... This side has the same issue, I would say. Yep, 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 yep. I'm going to not risk that and just add the same amount. Um, and have that be maximum, maximally used as well. Just so that we don't run into that issue. Now, I, I, I probably could add, because of, you know, adding of the boxes, we could probably add more robots down the center. But uh, for now, I just want to see, yeah, this is complete, this is complete. Should I add more robots to this? To fulfill these, because... It looks like, you know, this box doesn't go beyond 300 now. And this one neither. So, dividing it over a bit more boxes, obviously, is um, having having a little bit of a toll. So, we are at 250. If I add just 50 robots... If I add 50 robots, that's not a great, ginormous amount... Uh, of robots that um, would drain the system, but hopefully it does mean we have a, a, a little bit more, uh, about 20% actually, <laughs> more uh, ability to start filling up these boxes. So this one's getting to 1,000, so that's really good. Still 100 also being picked up from there. Um, yeah, we need to make sure that we can keep on uh, filling these boxes because we've got a filter here for 500 and we're only technically delivering to uh, To all of these actually so we could in theory just add a whole bunch more uh, Robots to this area because all of these boxes are not being utilized at the moment and I will say 300 robots are all oh Are all being used. Oh, that's ooh. Maybe I need to change that number Maybe I need to change that number, but we'll see. I'm going to add another... I'm just going to add another 100 robots, actually. I think we can. Uh, I mean, I can always take them away again. But I want to make sure that we we are able to uh, keep delivering that... Ooh, there's a lot of robots starting to fl hover here. I don't like the look of that. Wow. Yeah. 400 robots and all of them instantly working. I, I thought as much. Uh, I see some rings starting to happen around the ports. Yeah, me too, sir. Especially here in the middle. I was hoping that they would fly there, and I can't go lower, obviously, because, well, I would be touching that. I Theoretically, I could do... Let's have a look. If I move that up, I could do one more in the center here. That might actually help a great deal. And I can I can also go up because we already have that. So that should not be a problem. Hmm. I think that might be. We could even go all the way here. So we could add a few more, in fact. Huh. I kinda I think I kinda think we have to. Ooh, okay, there's 160 not doing anything now. What does the boxes say? Boxes say six. Okay, the numbers go up. That's good. All of them are being picked up, though. So we have... Okay, so now... Okay, perfect. Now we've reached somewhat of an equilibrium. So we've got 600 there, 700 there, and only, what, 30 there? That's fine being picked up. Um, I guess we can avoid hover... Well... Overage is not happening too much right now, seeing as we, um, well, we've got 100, well, 200 robots right now not doing anything. We've got less robots working now than when we, what we started with, but because, well, we did fix, well, we did uh, go over that little hump of trying to fill these boxes. By the way, how did that go on the other side? Is that actually going well or not? Oh, that's going fine. Yeah, that's, that's, I'm not even worried about that one. Uh, copper is used less as well, so that's fine. Um, yeah, a lot of robots recharging us in the middle of the center. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, here. Uh, but that's, that's, you know what? Fine. 
Uh, I'm going to place these ones here, empty these two, go like that and that, and... Oh, poop, sickle sticks. I was too slow. Go there and there. Take out these ones and I'll give them an extra one. I should be able to just safely die. I don't have any, I don't I? I don't. Let me pick up a new batch of robo-ports in here. What is that? Oh, that's just someone's chest, okay. There we go. Ooh, there we go. Ten just for me. Excellent. Excellent demo. Uh, this is steel. I need to be... There. Perfect. But, in the interest of symmetry, I should also do that up here then. Because um, otherwise it's just going to look jank. And I don't want it to. And I remembered that I forgot something. So I need to fix that as well. Copy and paste and paste and paste. But I also didn't do that for these ones, I think. Yeah, exactly. There we go. Alright, cool. Now everything's set up correctly. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Wait. Did I mess it up? <gasps> I messed it up. I'm an idiot. Sorry about that. Those ones, not those ones. These ones need to be taken away. And then that one can go there. Uh, and then we can go blip bloop. Perfect. Oh, and uh, blip bloop. Thank you. All right, we still have lots of robots not actually uh, working. But we do have a lot more charging ports in the center, which... Whoa, whoa. <laughs> That's a funky little hover over. Um, you know what? We've got, we got plenty. We've got plenty. And if they need more, then, uh, well, they will get more. Let's have a look. This is, this is being filled up. 100, 300, yes, this is being filled up. S same. Oh, this one's just full. Okay, perfect. And that one's just full. So, effectively, I've... Okay, I may have jumped the gun a little bit. But no, no, not really, because we did want an extra box. Because we got 600 here being picked up, all of them. We got 800 here out of 700 being picked up. So, we have a very, very small margin for when we need more iron. So this box will be the buffer for that iron. That uh, will go over that uh, buffer. Um, and then that one will be just future-proofing ourselves. Okay, so that is that. We've got more steel coming in. What is the steel count now, blah, 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 like now? It's the same, actually. Hmm, interesting. I think we're doing rather well. I think we're doing rather well. Um... Now that we also have more robots bringing... Oh, yes. That's what I like to see. Look at that. Because we've got more robots in the center row, we have we also have more robots able to transfer uh, those greens. Now it might be a, a matter of... Nope. Actually, nope. Because <laughs> now we've got, a, we've got a shortage of steel. No. Why is my life cursed? Um, Diablo, how many times is Squirrel on your to-do list? Uh, actually, not that much. <laughs> not that much. Okay, how much steel is being delivered? 72. 72. I'm doing exactly what's on my list, sir. I'm doing exactly what's on my list. I might be able to disguise it a little bit better than I used to be. But I'm doing exactly what I'm, I'm supposed to. Um, hmm. So I added a lot more. How many robots are flying here? So we... Okay, okay, okay. Should I add more? No, because we're already... Mm, we're requesting 200 and 200 are being delivered. So we could improve that a little bit. That would automatically mean we need more robots down the center. Urgh, this is so difficult. I'm going to go to four. I'm going to go to 500. Why the hell not? Uh, copy that, paste that in there, and paste that in there. All right. Now, I'm not sure that we can actually make that an increase because I can see them going to 228. Yeah, we definitely need. We definitely want to have more robots down the center. What's power doing now? 
Oh, easy peasy. Okay, lemon squeezy. There we go. I am at 1700. Let's go to 1800 for now. All robot. Nope, I'll go to the end. I, re I, I learned. I learned. Let's go here. We got more iron, so we don't need to worry about that. We see a, most of them go here. A few of them go there, but that's fine because we've increased that as well. Um, yes, all of them are flying. All of them are good. Are we seeing an increase in what's being delivered here? A little bit, yeah. Actually, about 100 more per box. So that's that's not bad at all. That is not bad at all. I might want to have or add some robo ports here, by the way. I might want to add some robot because I see if I see a little bit of um, um, circulation happening. I, I'm gonna do the same on this side just to make it a little, hey, just to make it nice and symmetrical, and hopefully get. Let's have a look at all of these because we ha we see that happening here as well. Uh, yeah, let's eat that one, place that one, place that one. So hopefully that cures that a little bit. This is actually fine all right this is there's a little bit happening here there's a okay i'm just gonna grab a new, a new batch of robo ports because i that's only five where's my oh steel i see you know what five is fine five is all i all i will ever need oh wrong one there we go i will do the up ones uh, up ones oh my god yeah, they're getting very uppity. I want those ones as well. So I want one, two, three, four more. Three more because I already have this one. That should alleviate a lot of the uh, charging delay. Uh, another one. That's fine. Uh, I'm going to place that one. Actually, I'm going to place that one here. Because I see more on this side than on that side. So there we go. Excellent. And we can we can keep filling this up, obviously, but we don't need to place more than we actually need to place, right? This seems fine. I might I might do the same here as well. We'll have to wait and see. But the more robots that can charge, the more robots that keep on flying. Um What is our steel buffer like? It has gone down a little bit. Hmm. The fudge is... Why? Okay. Hold on, hold on. Did I accidentally pick up a whole bunch of robots? Why are there 1,848 robots in this area? What the hell just happened? What the hell just happened? Did I did I mix my ma uh, my uh, areas? I don't think I did. No, I didn't. I didn't scroll. No, I don't. Oh poop! I might have crossed the streams a little bit. I did place one accidentally to the side. <gasps> oh no. All right, fine. I'll figure it out. How many do we have here? 400 is the correct number. 250, 240. Well, there's 10 missing there. Perfect. All right. Uh, 18 is never a number that's good. Never, never, ever a, a number that I want to see here. So that's definitely wrong. I'm going to steal that one. I'm going to steal Pope. Did not mean to do that. Steal you. Steal you, steal you. How many did I steal, by the way? Do I have eight already? No, I'd need two more. You and you. Oh, of course I did. One. There we go. Now there's ten here. I want to improve that, obviously. But more importantly, I want to make sure that we have the robots where we need to have them. Twenty seems like a correct number. Seventy seems... Oddly big, but sure, it's 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 a round number, so that's good. What about this one? One twenty-four is definitely incorrect, sir. Definitely incorrect. Are there any knots not moving? No, they're not. Okay, poop. All right, let's make them not move for a little while. So it's easier to pick them up. Yeah. 
There we go. Go to sleep. 124. I don't know. How many am I missing here? About... Uh, did, did I go to 1900 or did I go to 1800? I believe I went to 1800. So I have 48 too many in here. Wait. I have 40. Nice box. One, two. There we go. Right. 1800 perfect now I can turn everything back on again well after I change this one because 124 is also stupid so we're not doing that one two three four and then half of that plus two so that should be 100 that's 100 we'll see if that's enough I don't remember exactly how many we had over here but we're gonna find out uh, there we go that one there we go with that one there we go with that one there we go perfect Okay. I'm gonna see. We're gonna see how that works out. Ooh. But we do have a little bit of a buffer now. That's actually kind of nice. What is this request? A thousand. Okay. It's fine. But we're, on, we're. Why are we only storing? Our, well, it's actually fine. Yeah, that's actually fine. Um. Yeah, as long as these boxes can keep keep being filled to 100, to 100, that's absolutely fine. How many do I have left now? 80. 80 seems like a reasonable number. That's like, you know, uh, nice and even. I'll check the rest nonetheless. 60 seems fine. 50 seems fine. Let's teleport a little bit down. 20. I didn't go this far down, so this couldn't have been disrupted okay so we've got 80 robots that we s probably stole somewhere now that might have been from green and if we look at green we see that all all 100 robots are function functioning uh, working um whilst we still have these boxes being filled to 100 so yeah i think i'll just add not 50 that's too many I'm going to add 20. So we're going to go back to 120 on this one. I think that's okay. So that's 15. And that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Oops, wrong one. All of them are working? Yeah, all of them are working. That's that's beautiful. That's beautiful. 1800 is not going to change. This is... Yeah, we don't... We definitely don't need more there. That's way too much already. Um... I suppose we could add a few here, although I don't think we really need it. Um, you know what? It's fine. Let's add another 10 there. That is 20 robots, and they're all working, so I guess maybe we needed it. I don't know. Um, yeah, we should be fine. Why do we not have coal in here? Because we don't have enough robots to bring all that stuff. Okay, okay fine, 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 fine. Uh, uh, do I want more in steel, though? More in steel might be nice. Getting these buffers up. We're a little bit uh, dependent on, you know, how much steel we can actually produce with the um, with the amount of smelters that we have here. So adding more robots to this will help a lot, actually. Uh, how's our iron buffer here? Uh, our iron buffer is actually really good. Okay. Fine, I'll add... You know what? I'll give him the other 50. There you go. Is that too much? Doesn't seem like it's too much. And we instantly see all the... Okay, with the exception of that one for some strange reason. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, most of the smelters turn on. And being kept on. That's nice. That's nice. As long as that's functioning, I'm happy. I'm very happy. I might go to 2000... Um, 2,000 robots in the center today. I think that could be doable. I'm going to have a one last check over here. So, yes, these are 600 all being picked up. Yes, 700 being picked up. We see the third box being used. All 900 of them, actually. Wow. An overspill of eight into the, thir into the fourth box. Wow. That is... That is a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff being requested 
Oh my god. Alright, I don't know if it's... Yeah, I was I was afraid of that. Don't know if it's enough to keep all 1800 working right now, but... Yeah, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. JC... JC... VDT Twi... Or V... JC... Let me try that again. I apologize. JCVD Twitch. Hello, sir. How are you? Welcome, welcome. Um. All right. Jean Claude Van Damme. Really? Well, I'm honored, sir. Um. Yeah, I need, I need, I need so much more steel. I mean, we do have 40 steel being delivered, but honestly, that is not enough. That is not enough. I loved your movies, man. When I was growing up. Jean-Claude Van Damme. Yeah. Time Cop. I like it. I like it a lot. This is not good. Are all these robots working right now? Wait, how do how are not all the robots working? And I have a lack of well, do I have a lack? I mean there's 500 requested and there's 300 in the box and 150 delivered, so all 500 are being uh, taken care of, so to speak. We are just not offloading it or over whatever, putting it into the next box fast enough, basically. Alright, um, should I be adding another box? At least that would keep more robots working and have uh, have more available to us. But, strangely, we have a box of a thousand here that is not being requested of, or from, sorry. Um, does that mean we are supplying what we need to be supplying everywhere? Because it seems not, but... Status says, guys, lurk. Need to go educate a customer for a bit. Good luck with that one, sir. Good luck with that one. That is a tough job. <laughs> and I know. Uh, see, this box is full. This box is empty. We've got lots of iron here. So, I'm not too worried about this one. Um, and it's not so much that I'm worried about anything. I'm just trying to just determine... Yeah, I'm not. Why am I even looking at that one? Just trying to determine if we have, um, if we're fulfilling our needs, and it looks like we are. So I think we're golden. I mean, we've got 80 plastics being delivered. Uh, plastics is now the main blocker here for some inexplicable reason because we've got 80 being delivered, 100 being delivered there. So, yeah, we, sh we should have way, way, way more than we need being delivered at any given time. It has a bit of a travel time, so that could be it. Um, we do see 120 in this box, and all of them are being picked up. Um, lots of being, lo lo yeah, we are, this is, this is, this is fine. This is fine. Are all the robots flying? No, so we could we could make that a little bit better. Okay, here we go. Let's have there we go. Let's have another fifty robots. Is that too much? How many do we have in here right now? Twenty. I mean, everything's being kept up with. Uh, with the exception of plastics. I don't want to overdo this. So I'm going to go for 30 robots, not... Oops, that's my buildy bots. Give me back. Uh, I'm going to go for 30... Ooh, actually I might just go for... 
20 robots, because two robots are clearly not doing anything right now. Uh, we should see a great increase in this. Yeah, 100 being delivered, uh, which, you know, with this distance from this row to this row being so short, that should be really fast, uh, which means this should go up really fast. Yes, it does. Perfect. And all of them are still being picked up. So the surplus of robots that were not doing anything is being used to pick up those plastic bars, um, which is really good news, actually. And to bring the... Uh, call in here as well that's really nice to see as well i'm going to increase this a little bit to 100 yeah i'm going to increase this to 100 because i want i want to have a little bit of a, a a little bit of a bigger buffer here for these robots to deliver to these machines because i see these boxes being off often empty and i want that not to be the case if i can um and we still have a little bit of robots not doing anything in the center. So, you know, we can even make this a little bit bigger. What's the request here? Only 100, eh? But our box is full, so why should we worry? Yeah, never mind. I can make this into 200. And that should... Nope. <laughs> it doesn't even phase them. Very interesting. Uh, all of them are being delivered, so that's good. That means we have more in here. Yep, and all of them are being picked up. We should see less boxes empty out. Hey, yup, yup. Hello, sir, Mr. Archangel. How are you, sir? How are you? How many of these do I have? A zilch. Because I see some circulation happening here as well, which I really want to avoid if I can. Are we getting a new train already? How did I how did I set this up? This was a minus 1600 and we are only at minus 6. So we still have a a bunch of coal here in these boxes before it goes to minus 8 and requests a new train. Did I say 1600? I mean, I meant 16000. Sorry about that. Um I will say that uh, coal does seem to be a lot better now. Boxes are full, so that means that machines for plastic will be able to keep on keeping on why in the flying heavens do we not have petrol what the hell is going on so yellow's empty good red is empty good Lubricant is full, well, on one side because we're pumping it in to one box, which is fine, uh, and and it's being used, so that's 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 fine. Uh, I'm not too worried about that. We've got oodles and oodles of it before we run out. We do have a, a bunch of yellow here, which doesn't matter at all. Uh, I don't know exactly what we were doing here, but oh right, right, we're pumping it from there to there. And out to nowhere because we're not using it at the moment. We will be using it later. And this will probably go to the back. But we're going to find that out later. I survived another day that was supposed to be to kill me. So I can't complain. <laughs> I mean, I would like to complain, but I can't. Are you in China? Um, <laughs> sorry about that. Um, so why? I only see... Do we have an oil problem? Wait, do we have an oil? We have an oil problem. That's the problem. I see one, two, three burning, four burning, five, six burning. I mean, we are burning quite a hefty amount of oil. Um, but we clearly don't have enough because this is completely emptied out. Everything instantly goes into these machines as soon as it comes in. But there's clearly not enough. Oh, boy. That is interesting. Yeah, it comes in here, so the first thing it will do... Yeah, 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 okay, so that makes sense. Okay, I think it might be time for... Why is my lab man so lazy today? What is the research that I'm doing? Green, red, and black? We don't have black? Why is black being lazy? That one's working, that one's not. It is now. Okay, fine. 
why wasn't it working? We've got these ones direct ingesting and we've got like infinite amounts of bricks. So I'm not too worried about bricks. It's the bullets. It's the bullets that the pro uh, that's the problem. Didn't we have like 70 robots here? Are we not getting enough iron into this area? That would be hilarious. Yep. All right. Fine. Bloop. Let's quadruple quadruple the amount requested and we are instantly getting them and we still have robots not doing anything um <laughs> that should help though we've got four, four times the amount of robots bringing us stuff uh so that should help with the the amount that we have in here and thus the amount that we can use in this area and hopefully the amount of research we get out um yeah we hope uh, it is what it is. It is. There is no war in Bossing Se. <laughs> That's a nice reference. Upgrade the arms. <gasps> Did I not? You are absolutely right. This is a good suggestion. And why in the heavens is that up there? There we go. Uh, perfect. Yes. Upgrade the arms. Definitely. Definitely. Not that it needed here, but whatever. Ooh, actually. Wait, did I not do that everywhere? I can't believe it. Hold on. All of these have to be green, right? Otherwise we... Yeah, no, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The output is not here, but I'm going to say that wouldn't have mattered to much, uh, much anyway. Same goes for this one. I don't really care. And this one has... Okay, this one could benefit. This one could benefit a lot, actually. That's nice. There we go. Perfect, perfect. So that goes in there. We do have enough plastics. We are out of... Are we out of steel? Hold on. Nope. I thought we were, but no. We're actually quite good here. We've got a box full on this side. The only thing we care about, of course, this side. Uh, so all of these should be functional. What's the time on this? This is 20 seconds. I... I'm, I'm very confused as to why these boxes... How many robots do we have here? Okay. Anyway, problem solved. <clears throat> yeah, we're going to let that run for a while. We're going to let that run for a while. Um, yeah, all the other arms are upgraded. I might just pick up uh, another set of these. Only seven. I don't like that. Steel is the problem. Uh, Still, I want to pick up four. Four is a nice round number. Or at least it's an even number. I don't see any circulation happening here. Um, I still see a little bit happening here. It's a little bit. It's. I mean, it's nothing to worry about just yet. But I'm a little bit surprised to see them circulating here because... And yes, I do realize circulating is not the right word, but I don't care. I like the way it sounds. Because um, there's so many charging ports here. There, There is no reason for them to hover about just this one. Hmm. Hmm. I said ponderingly. Uh, oh, hello. New, uh, new uh, stuff being delivered. That's good. That's good. That's good. How empty is this box? This box is pretty empty. I can help out. There you go. Perfect. You can do the rest yourself and go away. Uh, just a quick glance at iron. Tells me that we are utilizing it quite well. Utilizing it quite well. Although I will say that we've got 200 robots not in fact doing anything. Which still kind of baffles me to be honest. Um... I'm, I, sure. Hey, as long as it works, I'm fine with not with robots not doing anything. Um, but we were about to work on some more uh, oil. I cannot do that though, and we're not short on anything, right? I mean, I see a hundred plastics here being uh, stored and pick up, picked up, so yes, that could be a little bit better, but for now that is fine. Um, it's not like we are struggling to maintain. 
What I want to do first, what I would like to do first, is figure out these exits. Is it time to upgrade the assemblers to level three? No, I don't think so, because we're having we're having quite a bit of difficulty to. Um, well, this is a bad example. It's we have quite a bit of difficulty keeping these boxes filled and the machines running. Uh, making the machines faster doesn't benefit us. It, in fact, makes things worse because it would be h even harder still to keep up um, uh, filling up those boxes uh, whilst the machines would start to use more passive power uh, or idle power. So if you look at a, um, a level 2 machine, it has a minimum consumption. So if it's not doing anything, it still takes about 5 kilowatts of power from the system. Now if we look at, if I can show you that, a level 3 box, yes, that takes two and a half times that amount. So if I upgrade all my machines, I will start to use at minimum two and a half times as much power than I have or than I am right now. So upgrading to level three is not a priority for me just yet. Now, if I have infinite power and if I have boxes that are being kept full and all these robots are, you know, picking their nose because there's so much material going around that they can easily be... Uh, keep up and we've got 1500 robots just for this green area and all as well then yes of course we will upgrade to level three but for now it's a power it's a power cost that i cannot uh, and don't want to oops wrong one and don't want to pay at the moment speaking of these exits though how do i want to do this because we're going to go from a singular system to a double system that much is clear and obviously this will still be a exit point because it it just so naturally fits into this exit point here i'm not going to where are you going oh there's a light there i'm going to turn my robots off i'm not going to change anything about that because that just works right as an exit point directly to the to the um bibbidi bops boobity boobity boop Depots, thank you. Um, question, however, is: Do we want to use these as in? Whoops, these ones as inputs as well. Now I did set the, set it up that way because I've got lights on both sides, and we've got this is an exit and this is an entry point. So we can set it up that way. Uh, that all of these could be entry points into this area. Um, you know, and it's it wouldn't be that hard because we could just go like something like that, and then just have, for instance, uh, center that upon that one, and then have that be there. There you go. That's how we would place it. We would have our single center out, going into that uh, singular singular line, uh, and we'd still have our input and output be correct with the roundabout that we would place. We are going to be a little bit close to the smelting uh, stuff there, but at the same time, I will say that really doesn't matter because the smelting areas are the biggest thing we have. So if that's the closest it's going to come, I think that's okay. Uh, if we look here, not even close. Yeah, and the other, other things are just smaller. The only thing that I do not know and I'm not entirely sure about is the uh, rocket area that we still have to build and perchance the um, the extra bits for the rocket area because I am, am in no way certain that we can build a rocket area with the uh, rocket fuel, with the uh, control units, with the... What's the third one? Oh, that's a low density structure where we already have that um, in one area and have enough of it to keep it at a going at a reasonable pace. So not one rocket every hour, but you know, once every five minutes would five minutes would be in I would deem to be 
okay. If we can make it better, hooray for us. But we don't need a rocket a minute or anything like that. Well, we can't do that because what was, what was that? Twenty. I think I had a rocket a minute every uh, in the uh, uh, laboratorium emporium, and I believe that was twenty-four rockets. Non uh, constantly building rocket parts to to get to that one rocket per minute. So, yeah, like I said, one per five minutes would be even um, amazing if I can reach that. The other thing that we need to think about is, well, we have this lab man here. If we want to have... Um, there's two things that we need to think about, by the way. So if we have the roundabout here that has the nice exit going that way, um, and the entry point working as well, that really doesn't oh wrong one that really doesn't count for this one because then we would have to have it there uh much further in and as you can already see touching the smelting area because now the exit still works for that exit um i could of course line it up like this but that automatically means that that's no longer going to be an exit we have lost symmetry that way and I despise losing symmetry. So maybe we don't do roundabouts. Maybe we just do these little bendy parts up on both sides and just have it be an exit and not an entry point. Uh, I mean, I could take away some lights. That's nice. It also feels less cool somehow. Do you know what I mean? It would be nice to have a train come from, I don't know, over here, bring the coal in this way, go into this one, or rather into this one, go up, deliver the coal, and go uh, back out again. Uh, that that would have been nice. And we can still feed in from the bottom. That would always be a possibility, of course. Um, but having, having that ability to sideload those trains... That might be cool. On the other hand, are we going to make it very hard on ourselves if we do that because of the trains that maybe want to go out while a train is going to want to go in? What is going to wait where and how the lighting is going to work with that? That might be a thing that we want to avoid, to be honest. Um, so, yeah, actually thinking about it that way, I'm just going to not... I'm just going to not. I'm going to have just these exits going up. I think that's the smartest move to make. Uh, and once we have that, we still need to clear out some of this stuff here. And that lab man needs to move. And some of this power. And all that stuff still true. Um, wait. Oh. I was going to say, where are all my robots? But I turned the thingamabob off. Um... Yay, there he is. A little lab man. Um, why is this not finished? It's too slow. I need more steel. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to make all of these just exits going up. Um, and again, I might shift it. When it's all built, I might shift it a little bit to change this connection a little bit. We're going to have to wait and see. Uh, I'm also going to move these uh, this fluid port train station thing, whatever, is not going to be a thing because we're not exporting any acid. Uh, but these two oil train stations can actually just go down and we can have one there and one there and both feed into these pipes down here to feed into our, bleh, where is it, Crem um, chemical plant right there. Um... Uh, maybe think about something to do with balancing that out. That might be nice. Uh, it also means we need to start building, at some point, uh, oil outposts, which we haven't done just yet. We've got two irons, two coppers, there's one, uh, a stone and a, coal, and a coal, and that's it. That's all we have right now. Okay. Let's start with, let's start at the very beginning, as Mary Poppins said. Uh, actually, it was uh, Julie Andrews in Sound of Music, actually. 
uh, and get ourselves an exit. Now, there is a th funny thing. I can, in fact, take away that one. And we've since we've decided not to make this an entry point, uh, we can take away that one as well. Actually, we can't because we've decided to, this is an ed exit point. We can take away this one because it's not an entry point. Yes. Correct? Think so. That one goes here, goes here, blocks there, which is an entire train, which is nice. Yes. Okay. I think that's correct. We have nothing going the wrong way, with the exception of this one, because it's not an entry, it's an exit. Yes. Not an entry, it's an exit. Okay, cool. Let's start actually at the top. <laughs> at the top. Uh, it's not... It's an exit, not an entry. Yes. Let me redo this a little bit, like so, so we have the right one, and I don't need to keep removing stuff. Again, this is a exit, not an entry. Good. If I take this and I flip it. Now, the lights are not going to be in the right spot, but the tracks are. Uh, hello, I want you to do do that. Thank you. Uh, we've got a little bit too much there. Now, this is definitely in the wrong spot. Uh, definitely in the wrong spot, but we can change that by moving that one. Uh, I, yeah, 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 yeah. I want that to be the same, don't I? Do I not? I think I do, actually. So, let's have a look. If I get that one there, then that one goes there. Poop. Uh, I have to move my eyes. Is this the correct spot? No, one down. There. Yes, that should be halfway at the top. Yes. Excellent. Um... Although this is actually uh, supposed to be this thing, so we can know what the hell's going on. Is that in the same spot? No, so we can move that down a little bit. I do want that in the second half, so we will have that there. I could do that there, which I think it, that's where it was. No, it was actually one up. Okay, never mind. I'm going to do that there, because that is the second half of that. Um, I'm going to leave that... Ooh, what am I doing? Oh, I don't want to build all that. Stop it. Uh, I'm going to leave that there and not there, I think. Yeah. Let's leave that the way it is. Um, one thing I will need to do is look at the distance between our lights here. Because I kind of want to keep that uh, a thing. I like that distance. It's half a train. Um, we can rotate that as well. Uh, thusly. Although now it's... I need to keep it this way. Um, and that should line up. Yes, it does, actually. <gasps> no! Okay, that makes me sad. That robot port's definitely in the way. Okay. Um, murder a robot port, I suppose. Yeah. Damn. That's... That's a little bit sad. That's a little bit sad. But we're going to ignore it for now. Um, I'm not going to pull this down just yet. I'm going to do the center row first. I want to have all these roundabouts be, uh, well, uh, the, the same, actually. Um, so I'm going to go like this. I'm just going to make sure that we have nothing. With the exception of rail and lights. This is a correct one, yes? So this is an entry point. Yes. Uh, sorry, an exit point. Yes. And this technically... I know this technically does not do anything. Right? Because it's not an entry point. We've decided not to use it as an entry point. Trains are not going to be traveling this way to exit this way. Um, need more iron outposts or increase the outpost boxes. Same for copper. Uh, we're going to have to... We're gonna, I'll, I'll check that out. I'll check that out. But I kind of don't like the look without 
them. Um, because then we're gonna lose that one and that one, and that just, I don't know, that just doesn't look nice. So I'm gonna leave those tracks in, even though they will never be used. Um, yeah, I, I just as an, you know what? Okay, here, create blueprint. What am I doing? That one. Where is it? That's not it. That's not it. That's it. Okay. Copy blueprint. Thank you. Let's, um, so we can recognize it now. Um, and let's take out Not entirely sure how far I can go with that. Yeah, see, I want that one. I think this is. I think this is correct. Uh, which one was it now? That one. Nearly correct. See, that's what it would look like. I don't know. It doesn't look right, does it? It doesn't look right. I don't know. It functions the way I want it to, but wait, where did I place it? Oh, there it is. It doesn't look right. I don't know. No, I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm not going to do it. Not gonna do it. Murder this one. It's disgusting. Absolutely horrible. Uh, the unfortunate thing, though, is that if I take wherever the hell it is, this thing, I can't just go like this, oops, like that, and go, okay, if there's no light next to it, delete it. So why in the hell did I make that blueprint in the first place? I don't know. Stop asking me questions. It's not like I know what I'm doing. So we've taken away that one. This one is a entry point, so we don't want that one. And we do the same on this side. Oh well, it's only six times. Six, right? I don't remember, actually. Uh, that's fine. We need to fix that anyway. Let's teleport over here. That's an entry point there. Did we actually place this one? Or Yep, we did, actually. Ah, but we didn't do that one. <laughs> Hilarious. Uh, that one's gone. Perfect. We still want this here because we still want the ability to go round and round and round. Um, and that's it. Okay. Let's go down. This side's the easiest because we don't have that little thing there. And actually, this one's the same now because we only had the, the two exits. So that's all fine. Okay. This is last two. Nope. Three. Dang it. I am almost there. Almost got that right. See, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's not that much. It's not that much. And then we can start to work on the outsides. How many robots are not doing... Actually, only 100 robots now are not doing anything. So, that's kind of cool. Uh, no and no and... There we go. All right, that's still an exit. That is still way wrong. So, <laughs> actually, can I use this thing here? I should be able to. Hopefully, there's not an extra bit of track. Oh, there is a bit of track there. Can I take that away safely? Yes, I can. That is very nice. I like that a lot, actually. Okay, that means I... Ooh. Hmm. See, I want to keep to the same distance measurements. But that would mean something like that. Or rather, go even closer and then have a, 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 a final one there. I want to be on that grid, is what I'm trying to say. And I don't know what the grid is right now. So for now, I'm going to keep to this grid. Which is wrong. There we go. Oh, that's not wrong, because that one is, yes, <laughs> going down, and this one's going up. Uh, and obviously, we want to have this light here. 
one, two, three, four. Yes, this light here. Is that the... Nope, we wanted it there. All right, so we'll clear that path. I know that none of this has lights yet. Why are you giving me this? Go away. Actually, this box is stupid. Let's do that one. No, stop it. Oh, wait, that's not mine. Cool. This box... This box is never going to get emptied. Well, it is. When when this runs out, it will. When this runs out, it will. Okay, so let's work our way up on this side. The um, quote-unquote easy side. Um, so that's a nice exit. We know what happens over there. Can we make this shorter? No, because this corner will not be uh, made shorter. Uh, this is the tightest corner we can have. This is a little bit in the way, because obviously this needs to go down, this needs to go there. It's all fine. Um, see, I still want this one to go there. And then I kind of don't mind this being there. That's actually nice distancing. Um, obviously that would check. Why the hell are there two? Well, this one's wrong. Um, so that distance is nice. Obviously, we would want to have this be the same. But, yeah, we've got a little bit of an issue here with a uh, <clears throat> a mine being there. Uh, Archangel says, request item. Bots, give Diablo said item. Request. Why are you giving me this? Yes, yes, I, I always question my robots. You should too, by the way. It's just sound advice i don't know what the distancing here is going to be that is interesting i honestly do not know what the distancing is going to be um so i think what i'm going to do is first check what my what my current distancing is wait why do i have two of these <gasps> oh right i made one without the stupid uh wait did i place it did i place the last one Wrong. No, I did not. Cool. We do have a blinky one here, but I'm going to ignore that one. I don't trust my bots farther than a spitter's range. Yeah, that one. <laughs> Alright, let's get rid of this. And there's... No, oh, there's actually no fake light in here. Perfect. Ooh, that one. Now there's a fake light there. No, what's happening to me? I'm being cheated. Wait, wait, wha, 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 what, what, hmm. Right, that makes sense. Because it's per three. So that would be, yeah. So I should have it. Huh. Wait. But that's still, and, but, huh? I know, Mr. Archangel, my lights do not align, which is very, very confusing to me, and I should not be standing on this track. Which is very confusing to me. Because they should. They definitely should. I'm going to go back up here and see what I... If I ca... Oh, Pope Sickle Sticks. Stop it. Hmm, what did I... No, stop it. I told you not to place that down. Stupid robots. Yeah, bring all my stuff back. Your mother was a hamster and your father smelled of elderberries. Indeed, sir. <laughs> that sounds like a cuss. Yes, 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 yes. Um, your lights don't align. That could definitely be a cuss. You're not quite there, man. Your lights don't align. Um, my robot's off. Yes, they are. 
Okay. See, that makes sense. That makes sense. That does not. I am insane. So the outer lights are always the same. It's just that one that changes, which... This is true. This is done on purpose, and I forgot about it. Okay. How to fix? How to fix? Well, technically we don't fix. I just grabbed... Yeah, I see what I did. I just grabbed the wrong blueprint. I need to have this be the lights that I need to grab. See, that lines up there and it lines up there. It, however, does not line up there. But that really does not matter. Okay. Okay, okay. Let's teleport all the way down. Hey, Mr. Rusty Troll. Hello, how are you? How is your day going? Mine's horrible because everything's not lining up. So in theory, I would start here. Do I not? Or would I start... Oh, this is actually a good question. Huh. Here's a question for you. Does this first light even line up with the, uh, with the grid that we have already established? I think not. I think not, good sir. Let's have a look. So don't get, don't get seasick now, but I'm going to move it up quite a bit. We should be still on the light. Yes, we are. We go beyond this and we get to that one. Not even close. Not even nowhere close. I'm good. That's nice to hear. That's nice to hear. 42? Life, the universe, and everything? Um... I do hate that you have made the outside tracks left-hand drive. What? Why would they be left-hand drive? I don't get it. Everything's right-hand drive, sir. Everything's geared towards right-hand drive. Hmm. One on the left goes up. Yeah, both of them go up uh, in a moment. Uh, both sides will be going up, but... Okay, F I'll, hold on. I'll show you just in, in a moment. I'll show you in a moment. Uh, no, the right one does not go down. The right one does not go down, sir. I will show you in a moment. Okay, I need to line up with... Actually, I need to line up with this one, don't I? Because that's the power pole line. Or the power pole one. I'm just dumb. No, 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 no. You're not dumb. I'm just bad at explaining things, apparently. Um, let's just keep, continue keeping research going, yeah? Okay, I need to line it up with this one. So, no, sea, no getting seasick, okay? Oh, I, I went a little bit too far. Okay, so that is the position... I need to... Oh, poop. All right, hold on. I need to do that one more time. So we don't aim, aim for that one. We aim for this one because we're going that way. Yeah, that's better. Okay, here we go. And there we are. Okay, so it's that one. So that's... One, two lights further down. So technically there. One, two, one. Yes. That is the grid that we want to be on. That is the grid that we want to be on. Um, so we take away this one. We take away that one. We take away that one. That's our starting grid, by the way. So in theory, we want to have it be there. Hello? 
Yes, you can do something now. Thank you. So, in theory, the next one would be right there. Uh, I don't care that it's a arm right now. I didn't know how to get my light up there quite, uh, quite that fast. Okay, so that is the grid that I want to be on, because now this grid is the same as the grid that is up there. And why is this not left-hand drive? Because this ends up, if we follow this all the way up, oh, poopsicle sticks. And I'll fix it later. Turn my robots off, please. Thank you. This ends up in this situation where we eventually go into a right-hand drive. So this is indeed a right-hand drive system. Um, if we were to have a roundabout here, it would go into the right-hand side of that roundabout. Now, the other side, I'm going to ignore this center part because obviously this is down and this is up, so that's a right-hand side drive as well. The other side, I have decided to also... Uh, use as an exit so this is also going up now technically the positioning of this track is the quote-unquote left hand side that is true that is true because if we were to have a roundabout here and line it up and make it symmetrical with the left side there we would see that the entry pole so the right hand side drive entry pole for that uh or entry arm for that roundabout would be connected to this exit pole or this exit point uh so it would be incorrect on this side but since we are uh only using this as a exit and from here again going into a right hand drive system i'm considering this right hand drive as well I've just done this here instead of there so that both sides are equidistance equals equidistant away from the center instead of having this be a little bit further out than that side and then everything's lop lopsided and I don't like lopsided so that's why this arm is a is technically technically on the wrong side of the road but since there is no other road to compare to, I don't see that as a problem. What is this? Old junk. It's fine by me. Can I move you? Yes, I can. And then I can do that. <laughs> I know I, was, I said I didn't want to do this right away. But you know what? I'm going to do this right away because I can. Um, I can also make a copy. Of, oh. I'm going to not do that. Wait, 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 wait. I'm going to have to redo this, aren't I? I'm going to have to redo this because I don't know where the grid is going to line up here. So we're going to, we're going back to map mode. We are going to find out where that grid is. There it is. I don't think I can measure it on that. So I'm going to, for safety's sake, I'm going to take this one, go all the way back down too far down perfect and we're going to say that's the one i'm going to place this one here not actually but just the ghost of that so we can get out of map mode and place a light exactly there so that is on grid which means that the grid needs a light there that is perfect. That is perfectly on grid with the rest of the factory, or the train system, I should say. And that is on brand as well. Uh, this is the same grid. If we measure this out, take this light, follow it all the way up, and yes, I do notice that too, uh, that hits that one. Um, I do notice that my train stations are technically not... Actually, yes, they are, because the train stations are on this tile and not on this tile. Ha! It is perfect once again. Whoo! Iron is completely dead for like two minutes. You made me scroll fast. Why did you do that? Right. 
I, I believe you warned me about this earlier, but I'm, I could be wrong. Where's my iron mines again? So we do have a train waiting there and a train waiting there. Uh-oh. Uh oh, no. Oh, no. What did I do? What did I do? I didn't change anything. What did I do? No path. Wait, hold on. What do you mean, no path? Seriously. Seriously, dog. What are you talking about? There's like lots of paths. Yeah, no, sure, no. Uh. I'm going to ignore the grid for a moment. And, oh, poopsicle sticks. I didn't mean to do that. Why does it say no path? Why is this temporary station no longer exist? <gasps> no! Life is hell. This reminds me of You Made Me Ink from Finding Nemo. This is true. I placed all these things down when I should not have. Oh no, oh no. Okay, here's the, th here's the thing that we need to do. Go away. Zoom. Robots off. Stand over here. Murder. 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 Mm, I can't see. Murder. And this one, not so much. Then control Z. Let's teleport out of here because I don't want to mess with these trees. Control Z, Z, and Z. Yes. Because I kind of do want these stations, yes? I want to be able to copy copy them later on for names and, uh, and the wires that they have attached. They should have <coughs> wires. Never mind. Anyway, I still want the names. Now, I need to get back to this train. Bibbidi bop. I need to tell this train. Oh my god, did I ruin the other one? Wait, was there only one here or were there two here? I need lights. The second one is waiting right there. I need to replace this temporary one with this temporary one. Go there, die. So that solves that problem. Now I need to do the same for this one, which is able to load. And is it going to the right spot? It is going to the right spot. Okay, so that's good. What about this one? Is this... Yeah, this is completely horribly off. Uh, which is weird, because this train station still exists. Am I wrong? Does this not have that train station name? Um, poop. No, it doesn't. Hold on. I need to go like this, and then we need to go like that. Starter, ah. Uh. Wait, 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 why does it say that this train station no longer exists? Is it turned off? I don't think it's turned off. No, that one works just fine. Oh, was this named something else? LTN starter iron ore drop off. <gasps> I'm a boob. Okay, that's fine. We can fix this. We can fix this. Uh, nope, that was the wrong button, but sure, I wanted to do that actually. And then I want to do that and move that one there. Get rid of that one. Uh, and then go like so. Then we can get rid of that and go here and go empty. You suck. Go. Thank you. This one needs to go there as well. Go. Ignore, ignore and go until empty. Okay, perfect. And now you are doing your thing again. I need to be careful with what I place down. Why does this one call Oswald Jack? That's a stupid name. Or whatever it says. Uh, this is the LTN. I 
I also don't want to call this starter anymore. I also want to rename those. Uh, wait, is this still called ore drop off? I need to fix that as well. I just want to call this the LTN coal drop off because that's what it is. So there you go. Uh, is this still ore? It is still ore. Or what? I don't know. Copper plate. No, it is copper ore. What am I doing? I'm drunk. All right. Everyone be quiet. You're all distracting me. This should be ore. This should not be plates. That was plates because I was smelting here uh, earlier uh, at the actual patch. But I'm not doing that anymore. So, yeah. My bad. Okay. Now that we've fixed all of our problems forever and ever. And we will never run into any other problems whatsoever again. Um, let's move this up a little bit so it's clean. That's fine. We can remove this box and this pole right here perfect we cleaned it up we cleaned it up that's uh, exactly what i wanted to do and uh, no other reason to be here not that i murdered everything um so that's good that's good that's good what was i doing right lights Let's go over here. Let's go over here. So in order to make sure that our grid still works, I'm I'm hoping that these two are actually a nice measuring stick for us to use. Um, so once again, I will go like this. Go up here. Uh, find the closest one, which is that one. And it is this one, so I'm going to go like that and place that one down there. That is our measuring stick. Oops, wrong one. There we go. And this is this measuring stick, which is now correct. Yes, this is now correct. It is not correct. Why in the heavens is it not correct? Because I placed it in the wrong side, because again... I measured this from the wrong point in the on the track. I measured it on this side and when I'm supposed to measure it from that side. So now it should in fact be correct. Yeah, that's perfect. Okay. Sorry about that, folks. Um I theoretically the next one would be there. Oops, wrong button. Uh, there. So if we take this and we place it there. Now we can do this one. Oh, that's interesting. This power thingamabob is in the way. Uh, turn my robot on so I don't have to worry about that. This is... Ooh, it only fits just barely. This one is interesting. Is it not an ore? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Uh, I'm going to move this out just a tad so I can have that be correctly placed. Okay, so in theory... I should now just be able to go like this. Get rid of everything we don't want. And use this as a blueprint for the rest of these lines here. Let's get rid of that light because that's definitely in the wrong position. I should be able to go like this. Turn my robots on. And have them place everything. Yeah. And that's is the last of our lights cool let me grab a bunch more because i believe i should have a box full of them yeah there we go and with only four being used per row we can last a bit huh we can last a little bit i'm glad i'm glad here we go that's that one let's move on down let's place that down and if everything has gone correctly and according to plan the last one that we already did should just fit this mold right here. And we... Oi, what? 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 There we go. And uh, we should not have to change anything. And if we do, then we're going to cry. 
Mm, maybe not, but still. It's going to be a sad day. All right, this is where we messed up. This is why, where I figured out, you know, this is incorrect. Yeah, all of these are incorrect. Perfect. Okay, well, let's go like this. Let's that, blah, 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 like that. Good, and now we can just go like that. And we should be correct. Or at least we're, we're correct in the sense that we are the same on all of these. Uh, and this should be incorrect too. Yes, completely horrible. How could you have ever let me build something as horrible as this? Actually, the last one is not the one that we've fixed first, I believe. Maybe it was. I don't know. I can't remember. Um, let's have a quick look. Oh, it was. Very nice. Very nice. So that's correctly set up already. The only thing that we have not corrected is this one. Uh, so, in theory, this would still go like this. Um, but, so, oh, seeing as we... I don't want to mess everything up right now. So, I'm going to say... 2-2 two, two, and let that last one be. So, there and... Second half? I think that's correct. Maybe not. We'll see. Yeah, that's correct. Okay, so these ones correct. These ones are correct. This one is not. But as soon as this is all cleared out, we can have a nice whoop whoop go straight up and make it look B E A beautiful. Yeah, Mr. Archangel says, yeah, we should just nuke the base and be done with it. No, we can correct things. We don't always have to nuke everything, especially my B E A beautiful creations. Um, so. This, ooh, that's an interesting conundrum. We also need to make sure that we have this grid, oops, wrong one, ah, yes, uh, correct. And, well, <laughs> we start horribly because the first light that we have down here is already incorrect. The real question then becomes, what is our uh, power grid? What is our power grid and what what is the what was the correct placement in the first place? No, don't do it. You stupid robots. I hate everything about every robot ever made. <clears throat> I can't do that. Hold on. Why do I have a million boxes with me? Just a moment, please. Uh, no, 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 yes. That's not smart. Let's not do that. Okay, so we got rid of a billion boxes that I just happened to have for some inexplicable reason. Um, I would like to go here place down an extra box or three, um, put all my stuff in there with the exception of you, then te oh, and, oops, wrong one, and you, I'll make a new one, and you, uh, and say, oh, I didn't need to make a new one for that, but actually that's fine, and show me everything, because this is horrible. I don't like the fact that I can't see what I'm doing. Go away. Good. Go oh, did it just automatically place that back? Yes, it did. Cool. And we're going to run into the exact same problem all over again. Awesome. Let's see if the trains are already stuck. No, it seems okay. Yeah, it seems okay. So I'm not going to worry about that for now. And I'm just going to not place these ones back because I really don't want to have that happen again. Because again, this is going to move. This is not going to stay here. We're not going to actually build that there. So in order to not have that happen again, we are going to ignore 
replacing those back and we're going to fix it later. It's not that big of a deal to not have that right away. Now, if we look at the grid, which would be these power lines right here, this would be the way to go down. Where would that place us? See, this should line up with that one, which I think it does. Um, I think it does? I'm not entirely sure now. Anyway, anyway, this is the grid that we want to work with. Okay. How do we translate this all the way down there? Time, he says. All right, Mr. Andrew. That gives me the opportunity to think about how we are going to translate this grid all the way down there. Yes, this grid is arbitrary as hell because I at some point just chose to place this down here. But once we do have that arbitrarily placed grid, I want to keep to that. Uh, that not only goes for the lights in the horizontal, but also for the lights in the vertical. You should have a playthrough which... Uh, which you nuke the base every time you make a mistake. Now, that's a horrible, horrible idea, because then I would never do anything. Um, how much of the Diablo non-squirrel to-do list is done? Let's see. I'll, I'll, I'll call it out for you. The blue chip boxes, I did. Power has been somewhat done, not entirely. Biters that need to be removed on the east, we did, and we moved the steel. That was all I had on my list. Everything else was everything that we ran into. So the only thing that I kind of did not finish, perhaps, but that was because we also did not have any um, solar panels in a box, was the solar panels over here. So, yeah, I kind of got, I kind of did everything on my list. Um... I will be trying to figure out how I can transfer this grid all the way down to where we actually want to have it. And um, let's see if that changes anything, by the way, because we do have a nice grid. Oop, let's not kill ourselves uh, in here where this and this, the power poles between the two roundabouts are exactly at max distance apart. So we could use that as a grid as well i'm not entirely certain by the way if these are max distance apart but i believe they are uh let's let's as a final thought experiment try that out so we place this down we place this down thank you we take one out can we no see this was built by i can't remember who uh someone someone that helped out um and that is indeed max distance apart so if we are going to work with a grid that is max distance apart then why not work with this grid instead of what we have over there uh, which might not line up with what we have over here i think that's smart because it is also somewhat centered around our blocks here um that is going to be it for today uh, we are going to figure out our vertical placement of our lights next time. We're also going to do the right-hand side on Sunday, which involves a lot of moving of stuff. So we're going to find that out. We're going to find that out. How do you nuke the base when an atom bomb is late-game research? Uh, it's a good question. It's a good question. Uh, manual nuke. Just go every time I deconstruct something. Or I don't know. I'm just spitballing. Uh, <laughs> that leaves me with only one thing left to say. And that is to say thank you to my patrons for sponsoring this channel. It helps and motivates. Thank you very much. And to anyone else, I'll say thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe to the channel. Comment down below if you have any suggestions or ideas. My name is Diablo and I will see you next time. <laughs>